Welcome or welcome back on C-Square. On this video clip we will talk about uh, standard form and vertex form of a quadratic. And uh, first of all let's take a look on these two forms. Uh, the one on the left uh, right here is the standard form. this one uh, with a short summary h and k are the coordinates of the vertex uh, x equals h the axis of symmetry and also you see the domain and the range uh, and uh, the one on the right is the quadratic function in standard form and also you can see a couple things about how you find the axis of symmetry if you have that form uh, and the vertex and how you finish the graph in case you need it by using the y-intercept. Um, in this video clip, we're gonna look how to go from standard form, right, number 13 and 14, both equations are in standard form, to the vertex form. And there are two ways behind this one. We're gonna use uh, the last part of the previous slide which says, if you remember, x equal negative b over 2a. So in this case, we have negative, which is the negative that is in this quotient. And then we have negative 4 over 2 times 1. Uh, for those who do not see why, b is negative 4 and a is positive 1. If we simplify this uh, quotient we're going to get positive 4 over 2 which is 2 x equals 2 is the axis of symmetry if you remember but also the h the x coordinate of the vertex now we have to find the y coordinate of the vertex and if you remember we have that f of b negative b over 2a which means nothing else than, in our case, plug that 2 in your original equation. So we end up with 2 square minus 4 times 2 plus 6. Which is going to give us positive 2. That positive 2 in this case is the y corner of the vertex or, or k. And now we're going to do the last step which is plugging this two value h of 2 and k of 2 in our vertex form. And one more thing, we also can plug A uh, Don't forget, A is 1, B is negative 4 And we don't really need C So we have Y equal 1 times X minus 2 squared plus 2 Or the simplest form would be X minus 2 so this is the standard form and the other one is the vertex form they both represent the same equation go ahead and try number 14 
So if you have the answer y equals 2 times uh, the quantity x minus 5 over 4 square plus 71 over 8, you did a wonderful job. Uh, standard form of, uh, right here on top, oops, the other one, and uh, uh, vertex form. Uh, notice I use fraction, however, if you want to use decimal and a calculator, uh, go ahead. If you enjoyed this video clip, don't forget to click the, the like button down on the right and come back on C-Square for more math video clips.